The city council pushing the vote to next month, but saying the public will now have input at five upcoming meetings. ABC 15's Mike Pelton joining us live and Mike, the Sun's owner just breaking his silence. Yeah, literally just a few minutes ago, the Phoenix Suns tweeting out a video from owner Robert Sarver, who says he is 100% committed to finding a solution to keep the team right here in downtown Phoenix. Now, this comes as the deal to renovate this arena hangs in the balance. Today, we talked to one of the Phoenix City Council members who would have voted no on that renovation deal about what it will take to vote yes. The potential deal to renovate Talking Stick Resort Arena comes with a price tag, $150 million from the city, $80 million from the Suns. Keep in mind, the city owns the arena. The council was kept in the dark on a lot of this, so how do you vote on something and don't even know what you're voting on? Phoenix City Councilman Sal DeCicio tells me he would have voted no, citing in part a lack of transparency. You need to know where all the monies are being spent. So I'm not going to feel comfortable. I did not feel comfortable with that deal. I thought it was a behind the closed doors deal that city staff put together. While the vote was delayed on Wednesday, the public documents on that table deal list total renovations around $230 million. But under the items that need renovating, everything from the roof to the team store, there's no specified dollar amount. What would get me to a yes vote is where we find out exactly where the city of Phoenix is responsible for, what infrastructure we're responsible for, the bells and whistles, the fan experience stuff, that's all the sun's responsibility. But until we have a report in our hands, until the public is able to evaluate it themselves and give us input, then there should be no vote on this. Now a representative for the city of Phoenix tells me more public documents will go online soon. Now today we were told the city manager not available for an interview. We also requested an interview with Mayor Williams, her office though, only saying that her thoughts are the same as when she spoke with us earlier this week, that renovating and that renovations are necessary since it is a city owned building. For now we're live in Phoenix tonight, Mike Pelton, ABC 15, Arizona. All right, the saga continues. Thank you, Mike.